are watching Faith World TV. Faith World TV, changing the world with the Word of God. Wow, good morning, good evening, good night. Wherever you're watching, welcome to the broadcast. We are coming live from the Sky Channel 589. And you know what? It's been wonderful to come back again because the world is just on the stage of recovery because of the COVID-19. You know, a lot of countries are just getting back into the traveling. Uh, many countries are still restricted. Uh, companies just getting back. Churches as, as well as seen a lot of challenges in COVID. Uh, but we thank God that you are alive. And, you know, this program, matter of fact, this was actually planned two years ago. So the privilege we have to have him all the way from Aberdeen, ladies and gentlemen, is a privilege to have Dr. Mark Osa Egonhor. Welcome, sir. Good morning good afternoon yes, good sir. evening wherever you are yes indeed such a joy to be in london again yes indeed i live in scotland uh, yes. which is part of another kingdom but it's yes. been two years my <laughs> goodness yeah <laughs> so it's actually good to us to meet again and it's also good to to be able to reflect on what has happened that's right yeah. covid as well too. that's right so that's, that's how has church coped with the challenges of covid 19. well it's been a very interesting time okay um obviously um the churches were shut down for a long period yes, in now yes, in scotland yes. it was a bit longer than most places yes um so we transited to becoming a digital church wow, you wow. know first of all wow. digital you know online That's streaming it. with minimum um team in the in the church premises mm -hmm. and then eventually um and which is where we are right now is both yes. a mix of physical and, and Jesus know. also digital so wow. so that's what we call that we, yeah. we God, we you came right now from you know scotland uh what's the vision behind when god sent you to aberdeen and tell us about the church and the vision really what god has put in your heart i tell people that i'm a missionary yes you know and sent from africa yes although i mean part of my schooling and all that he was was here you know, was here in, actually in london mm -hmm. but then the time came when i was uh, sent out you know um from interestingly by my company i was okay. working for a company that sent me to aberdeen on okay. international posting but then i was already a minister a pastor so the church said well um, we also sent as a missionary. That's right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, counting many years now, I'm still a missionary, and wow. then the company work is is, is, is is done and dusted. Absolutely. Thanks be to God. So, we are missionaries, and as you would know, um, for many people will know that the, the, some people say, not our, not our story, or that Christianity is declining in Europe, you know, and some even say, you know, by so and so years, you know, the number of, of, of Christians would have become minority. That's what they say, but I tell people, well, God has a different plan, and we are part of that plan to see a Europe revived for the Lord, is see the gospel flourishing once more across Europe, to see churches being planted. You know, right? yes, lots of churches have been closed, and we see that a lot in our city as well and other places. But part of our mission from God is is to expand God's kingdom, to preach the gospel everywhere, you know, and and to re, to re plant churches, you know, and to gain much ground again. So that's what we're doing over there. Um, this, the, our church is called Jesus House, City of God. The name came in many ways as the City of God because when we first came into Aberdeen, uh, our, our, our local city, we saw that, you know, a lot of the church buildings were being closed, you know, and it, it was said then, I saw one of the newspapers where they said that Aberdeen was then the most ungodly city in the kingdom because of the number of churches being closed. Um, but we, we then lifted our voices towards God, the Lord will, will, we would, we, would, we would put a new name, declare a new name of our city called City of God. And um, and when God eventually gave us our first building, and that was early an old church building built in 36, we found the scripture was there waiting for us, um, Joshua 6, 16b. So so that's the vision behind mm. us, it was just to make sure that the, the, the fragrance of God, that's you know, right. the knowledge of God spreads everywhere. Wow. We are a kingdom-minded church. Wow. I, I, we, we, we're not about building our own church, mm -hmm. building our empire. Mm -hmm. We're about God's kingdom. That's right, yeah. that's right. And also you launch the SBIS, yeah. the Kingdom of God School, <laughs> uh, which has come actually very useful in the time of the, the lockdown and yes. you know the COVID. Yeah. Because I've attended to one of them and it's really impactful. So I encourage you as well to get this information about the SBIS, Kingdom of God School. Yeah. 
what's the vision behind it? So um, about four years ago, yes. three years before the before what, yeah. lockdown, we said what is called SBI. It's, 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 it stands for uh, um, Summer Bible School of Scotland. So Summer Bible wow. Institute of Scotland. Wow. Summer Bible Institute of Scotland. So we said of that every summer we gather our youth to, together. Mm. You know that is those between some about sixteen all the way down to um, in fact two two groups, the teenagers and then uh -huh. the ones in campus That's and all right. that. Uh -huh. So we we'll sit down with them for a couple of weeks. Yes. In, you know, in on ground in in a summer. Yeah. That's what we we're doing, and very transformational. The first year, we actually had um, some two brothers come all the way from Israel. Wow! You know, and 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 then so we we're teaching them also the innovation. You mm -hmm. know, through mm -hmm. the gospel, because you know, it, you know, through the gospel, yes. and and it was just amazing. Wow. So we've been doing that for three years now. During the lockdown, obviously, we couldn't do the physical. Mm -hmm. So we decided to do it all online, the online. Yeah. and this time it now became for everyone. Including no matter no, regardless of how old you are, we've That's had right. people 60, right. 70 joining, wow. you know, and it's a global school. Mm. So the school is all about the kingdom of God, mm. all about the kingdom of God. Mm. Because one of the greatest, um, one of the greatest, uh, should I call it, the challenges we have in the body of Christ today is that many people know about church, many people know about about career, business, but we don't have so many believers knowledgeable about the kingdom of God. So our focus in the school is. All about the kingdom of God. We we we, we teach, um, you know, about who is the king, the Lord Himself. You know, who are the citizens of the kingdom? We are supposed to be this. The, 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 we are rather we are the, the citizens of the kingdom. We teach about also the enemies of the kingdom. So uh, we, of course, the chief enemy is Satan. We teach about his taxes, how what he does. Then we then go into the, how the kingdom of God looks like. For example, if I were to ask you now to somebody, oh, describe London to me, or give me some landmarks in London, somebody would say, oh, Be uh, Big Ben, for example, you know, um, House of Parliament, House of Parliament, you know, Buckingham Palace. Um, so what we then do also in the Kingdom of God school is that we then begin to talk about the landmarks of the Kingdom of God, so that when you're in the Kingdom of God, you should know the things that that relate to the Kingdom of God, you know, and then of course. We also then show how do we manifest the kingdom of God? How do we expand the kingdom of God? You know, and that's what the school is all about. It's mm. all about mm. the kingdom mm. of God. And I can tell you, um, incredible miracles have taken place. Wow. And so usually we hold it in in, in, um, in the UK time is night, but everywhere else, you know, uh, everywhere else depends on what the time is and uh, uh, other places. Every course, every course within it takes about seven weeks. You know, we have 501, we have 401, we have 701. It takes um, seven weeks on, on each occasion. Yeah. And we do it free of charge. We ask people to, to donate because, mm -hmm. you know, uh, towards it. Um, there's been miracles, wow. you know. And one of the wow. most amazing miracles for me, a frightening one, was um, there was a lady from somewhere yes. not, not far off from here. Mm -hmm. She joined our our five course two last year last summer mm -hmm. online and she joined it like sort of like midway yes and and she joined um and then she joined the black night and at the end she was saying because uh, um, at, at, at the end of it we always have a reflection everyone yes. share what you have taken away and we also have application as well everyone has to go and do something what they have received mm -hmm. you know and then she was sharing the first evening she joined said you won't believe what has happened now so we're all like what's going on here she said she joined SBI is not because somebody told her, mm. but because you know, um, even Brian suggested it. Okay, her. <laughs> wow, you know, wow, even Brian. Wow, wow. So she turns up, and then at the end of the evening, that first class, very first class, she says, "You you can't believe what's going on." You wow. kept saying, "You can't believe what's going on." Mm. He said she's been having. Uh, she's been having a, 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 a difficult situation of, of, of about three, four years. Mm -hmm. You know, um, you know, the the, the 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 spirit of death has been over and over her. You know, um, somebody very close to her passed on, and that wow. is was as if the truth were transferred to her. Wow. You know, I said they, they've done everything. They've fasted. They've prayed. You know, thank God for fasting, but with mm -hmm. all of that, mm -hmm. gone, but nothing happened. Right. But she said, why the class was going on in her first class, two and a half hour class. The whole challenge of this, the, 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 that evil spirit of, of, of death, of, of, of wow. death wow. just disappeared. Wow. So at the end, she was on, and this is just in a class. Wow. In the class. And why is this? Because obviously all the things she's been doing have been part of, you know, sowing the seed. Mm. But then the word of God, when you sit on that God's word, That's right. great things happen. Amen. You know, Amen. there's know. transformation. <laughs> yes, transformation. <laughs> it, it seems like you got the anointing for schools because uh, you've been also having a teaching series or a school of uh, the school of ants, the school of uh, time and season and fulfilling destiny yeah. and the school of Joseph. So you have this anointing of teaching series because you want to impact, I believe, the the, the people of God yeah. with knowledge. 
and that's what the Bible also reminds us of in Jeremiah three fifteen of that. You know, I give you shepherd that will you know will teach you with knowledge and understanding. And I believe this is the kind of teaching we need to, uh, in the kingdom and the body of Christ, yeah. so that we can live a fulfilled life. Now you've been teaching about the you know the school of ants. Tell us a little bit about you know those series. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's uh, it's amazing. You know, um, the school of ants is yeah. it's, it's comes from the book of um, Proverbs yes. chapter thirty. From when you read from verse 24 to 28, it describes four creatures mm. that are so wise. You know, what's interesting about that, that, that part of scripture is that, first of all, it, it describes some very distinguished animals mm. in mm. nature. Mm. You know, it talks about the lion, it's, mm. it's, it's, it's majestic, you know, yeah. and all that. Yeah. But, but then, it, then it then goes, so let me, let, the Bible then says, okay, let me, now let me go and learn wisdom, you know, from these four creatures. What's interesting that he doesn't ask us to go and learn wisdom from the lion. Mm. Wow. You know, as dignified as majestic or the it doesn't end, or the you know, no. Yeah. But the wisdom he says go and learn from four creatures. Mm -hmm. And the first one is the ants. Wow. I mean the ants is if you have a mode of ant here, you can squash it, you can do anything with it without even thinking twice. But God has loaded the ants with so much wisdom. I believe the, the ant itself mm. is a school for us to go and study. So we, a lot of the principles that God is trying to teach us that we, we find it difficult to understand sometimes. God uses um, different ways to teach us. He uses nature. Mm. He uses he uses the he ant as well. He uses the ant as an example. There yes, are four creatures yes, there: yes. the ant, the conium, the the spider, and the, and the locust no, and the spider. Yeah. There are four of them. Mm. You know that, that that God uses there. You know, so the ant is 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 a study. Mm. And what's interesting is it's not just us studying ants. Scientists have been studying ant wow. for ages. That even to today, are studying, scientists devoted to studying ant, and they keep unveiling new secrets yes. that we don't yet understand about the ant. So I believe that the ant itself mm. is a school that wow. God has given to us. So if wow. you can learn wow. from the ant, I, I bet you, you know, um, you would have, um, you, you have great wisdom to, 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 to mm. prosper in life, to succeed in life, but even more importantly, to understand what God has given to you and yes. us, you know, what we, what we have mm. in Christ mm. Jesus. Mm. Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. And I believe these are been made now into series available to order. Yes. So, so, so the, 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 we have the series now. Um, we, 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 when we, when we put them out, thanks be to, yes. to, to Richard, <laughs> yes, Richard, yes. Richard was, it was the studios where, yes. we, where we did all, all the recording. I've taught yes. them in, in, um, in, in, I've taught them in various places over the, over the world, That's right. um, in, in parts, mm. and I've also written about them, mm. not published yet, you know, but, um, was with Richard, then we just went to the studio and packaged into it. And we, every time we, we did a new one, we released it. But now people have been asking for it, so we pack, package them all into a series, into a set in a series, mm. you know, on, 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 and then you, you can order the, the, the CD drive, that's right, that's right. you know, the, well, the flash drive, and then you can get it all there. Uh, let me just give you some, uh, one example of, of the ants. The Bible says the ants, you know, um, it, it stores its food in the summer. You know, it stores its food in the summer. You know, you wonder how come the ant knows how to store food. Now, the lion, if the lion needs food, he has to go and hunt every day. Every day. Yes. If it doesn't, if it if it cannot uh, find a prey, mm -hmm. then it goes hungry. Wow. Wow. But the ants. Now, we're in not a hemisphere, we are in the autumn now, we are mm -hmm. living, mm -hmm. we've left summer, we're in the autumn, and so we're going to winter. winter yeah. The ant doesn't go hungry in winter because it's, they had, the whole colony has preserved food. They store food. Wow. The ants, the ants, they, they, they know how to, to keep food. Mm -hmm. They know how to farm. They have, they have, they have, they have mm -hmm. and they, 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 let me just give you some. Let me just, let me just, <laughs> let me just blow your <laughs> mind. Let me just blow your mind. They, they and this ants, is the time hands. Yes. Oh my God. God. <laughs> you know, first of all, they know how to prepare. How is that? How amazing mm -hmm. is that? Mm -hmm. They know how to prepare. How many of us in life know how to prepare properly for oh seasons? Goodness. Most of the time we are embarrassed because the season turns up on us and we were not prepared. Mm. Yes. You know, but the ants, Bible clearly tells us is that it prepares its food in the summer. In the summer. So it doesn't get embarrassed in winter. <laughs> I tell you a true story. There was a, if a, 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 I was working in a company once, mm. you know, and um, there was somebody in a, in, in a department not far from us mm. whose wife put to bed, mm. you know, and um, when the wife put to bed, he was running around looking for help, mm. you know, from so his his the boss of his boss mm. who was um, a fine Christian gentleman, so he wasn't a wicked guy, yeah. you know, he he made a decree that nobody should help that man. Wow. But the people were like, why do you say that? The man said, God gives everyone nine months to prepare for a baby. So if he couldn't use his nine months to understand why, where he needed help and to ask for help, yes. then he wasn't designed to have help. 
My you know, God. so but the ant never gets embarrassed because mm, it prepares mm, its mm, food mm, in the mm, summer. Mm, it's a wonderful pair. What else about the ant? The ant is, a, is one of the most specialized creatures. Wow. In the ant colony, everybody has an assignment. Everybody wow. has an assignment. Wow. They, you, you, of course, you, for those who know this a little before that, I mean, we grew up near nearer nature. You know, they so their ants. Yes, they are the ones who yes. keep the 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 praise the the the, 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 the praise out of the colony. Mm -hmm. They protect. You know, they have the the farmer ants who actually farm. Okay. <laughs> you, need get, you, you need to get the series. You, need to get it. So you can go deep. You know. So there's they, a farmers. The, the farmer ants. They, they actually farm. They even have the nurse ants who looks after the younger ones in the colony. <laughs> wow. It's amazing. Oh, let me blow you out of mind. Do you know um, how um, how the 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 THL and all the, the who do the, the of force. Force. Yes. That concept came from a young man in America who studied the ants. Because the ants they create roads. Wow. They have one of the most sophisticated. Wow. In fact, the the, the the infrastructure of the ant world mm. is, in the colony. is in the colony. It's more sophisticated than many of the countries we see. And this is just a tiny ant. Just a tiny ant. So we they have roads. They have they have they have everything else. So it was wow. that concept that 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 this, this this somebody studied in his in in, in, their, in their in their in their in their in in, in university in mm -hmm. research, mm -hmm. and then they then wrote. They wrote the first concept of of uh, of, of career distribution wow, out wow, of that. Wow, wow. <laughs> and, 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 so why should we, the Christian dom? I mean, what the message are you trying to convey here in these teachings? Well, the word of God is 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 powerful. Yes. The word of God is the word of God. Yes. The word of God is Christ Himself. That's right. But then the word of God also is the is the is the why is is a book of great wisdom mm. for succeeding in life that's right a lot of people are, a lot of people including myself we struggle in life sometimes because mm -hmm. we don't have we don't have we don't apply the wisdom now we as christians ought to have the greatest advantage in life that's right because we have this, mm -hmm. we have God, we mm -hmm. have the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. but unfortunately, that's not the case. Wow! So this, unfortunately, that's not the case. You know, so a lot of a lot of believers are are not walking in victory, mm -hmm. as they ought to work. As, as as they ought to walk, they're also not walking in 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 in, in, in if like in right principles before God. Mm -hmm. So some people get into doing all the wrong things that is annoying to God. Wow! It's upsetting to God. Wow! So instead of getting better things things get worse wow. you know so that's why we need to get this with you because it's Absolutely. there for us free of charge unfortunately or mm. fortunately is unfortunately a lot of unbelievers mm. are gaining more with this word of god than we are my goodness yes yes you know when i read mary Kay, i don't know if she's a believer or not mary Kay cosmetic mm. but mm. she yeah. said that the principle of her you know how they do the how they do their marketing mm -hmm. home and all that mm. that she saw it from jesus's principle the early wow. church in Acts of Apostles, wow. you know, where they were meeting from home wow. to home. Wow. That's where she got the. Wow. Wow. That's where she got you know, it from. You know, this subject is, is an. Is a, it, that's why we say you need to get it serious because it's available now. Yes. Uh, and and also before we go to the next one, uh, in fact, also if I may continue, you have also gone to the teaching of the school of Joseph. Yes. Of time and season fulfilling mm -hmm. destiny. Yeah, yeah. Uh, briefly tell us about that before we can know how to get all of this series. Wow, wonderful, and and of course we we also do we also do uh, teaching uh, teaching and training for churches Absolutely. as well too. Yes. So if you know how churches and mm -hmm. groups that want to come alongside them, mm -hmm. you know, um, uh, early this year we did one for one of the countries. You yes. know, yes. we even organiz commercial organizations as well, business organization, governments. Mm -hmm. uh, we do a lot of training for them as well too. So Joseph is a great is a great mystery. Mm -hmm. Here is a young man who was sold into by his own brothers into slavery because he had these dreams of greatness of grandeur, mm -hmm. and they were upset about that, and then they. they they, they try to kill him and then they sold into slavery. And yet this man then becomes, you know, eventually becomes prime minister of or grand vizier of, mm. of Egypt, Asian Egypt. Yes. It's amazing. How can that wow. happen? Wow. You know, but the the, 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 the the we see a number of things through his life. One mm. of them was he understood times and seasons. You know, he he understood times and seasons and then he could interpret times and seasons and what to be done in times and seasons. Wow. You know, it's not, it, 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 so yes, we wanted to know time and seasons, but what to be done. I mean, we're just coming out of the lockdown now, yes. isn't it? You know, most people never predicted, uh, mm -hmm. almost no one predicted, uh, well, the way it happened, very few people really understood it. Mm -hmm. You know, even some of us that may have uh, unintentionally said it, we didn't know what we were talking about. For example, that year I, I declared for our people that, you know, that is the year of a uh, of a uh, of of a uh, of, of, of fire, mm -hmm. you know, of of, of 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 fire. But I didn't know what that meant, you know. Wow. Uh, in, in fully, I couldn't wow. say oh, I, 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 no, no, wow. I didn't. But 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 when 
But then what, what we see is that, you know, we need to understand times and seasons, mm. you know, and when we don't understand times and seasons, it causes great tragedy. Mm. Um, our Lord Jesus Christ lamented, he said, the, the Israel uh, as a nation and Jerusalem mm. failed because they did not understand when Messiah had gone. They've been talking about Messiah, mm. they've been preaching about Messiah, they were looking for the Messiah, but when it turned up, they didn't understand the Messiah. Mm. You know, so wow. as believers, wow. if you're going to gain a uh, great vision life, you need at, at least among the community, those who understand times mm. and seasons and what, what what should be doing. Now, here we are now, post-lockdown. You know, the whole world has changed. Mm. But most, so a lot of people still understand the world has changed. We're wow. still thinking and functioning the old way. Wow. Now, we should be thinking about what is the new way? What's That's the right. new, and That's working right. with God? That's right. I hear a lot of bad people talking about, oh, the enemy is doing this, and mm. enemies are, so I ask them, okay, what's your own agenda? Right. Mm. You know, so wow. that's why we need times and seasons. And Joseph is a, is, a, is a wonderful case study. You can spend mm. a whole year studying that, Joseph absolutely. to understand how he walked in times and seasons. And also, yeah. all of this I'm now made into series. Yes. Now, most importantly, how can we get how can we get this? And also, in case we have any question, how can we contact? Wow. So, so on, you will see, um, yes. you will see uh, our church, um, the, the the church uh, address there. But I also have my own personal website. If if you want to also go uh, go there as well, it's called www.doctordrmark. Igihon you know, so 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 that's that's my own personal website. You can you can go you can, you can go there. Um, you can find me on on LinkedIn as well. Uh, you can find me on Facebook. You know, you can find me on uh, Instagram. So so and on YouTube as well. And on, and just shoot us a message, and we'll be able to respond to you. So we're available for 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 for, for training, for 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 encouraging people, uh, for mentoring as well, to discipleship. You know, we're all of we were available all, all in all of those measures just to see that the the people get blessed and transformed fantastic you know we're running out of time and as i said before we need a whole series of of, of time to go through some of this powerful teaching that you've released mm -hmm. but uh in case you're just watching you're watching richard cunningham we're live at uh, sky channel 589 and across the social media uh we have a special guest all the way from aberdeen from jesus house dr mark osa egon her and I want to use this opportunity as a man of God to just minister to somebody out there. I know we're running out of time, but these three minutes, just speak to somebody that what God has put in your heart, please. So, what a great pleasure to come into your space. And I want to say to you that the world is changing, but God has also arranged for you, for, you to, for a change. And this is going to produce a better situation for you. So I pray for somebody this morning. I, I don't know where you have been struggling, but I tell you, you know, there's, there is beauty around the corner for you. There is beauty around the corner for you. Where men are saying there's a casting down, you know, you should be saying, and I and I encourage you from today to start saying that there's a lifting up. Uh, the trouble has come, seasons of lockdown has come, but now it's time for uplifting, time for a new showing, a new, a new, a new showing in the name of Jesus. I'm also praying for somebody this morning. You know, um, you're a little bit confused of what's going on in the whole world right now. I encourage you, just 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 have this confidence that God is in control. God is in control, and all things will work together for your good eventually you know what you have to do is stay focused on god don't get distracted there's somebody this land that you're about to take a very very uh, precipitous decision you know and that decision is going to be a wrong one you know I, I can sense it because you you are being motivated by fear you are being motivated by anger and a sense of betrayal but no 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 don't do that anymore rather just calm down you know s go and sit down with the lord and try to understand what is going on right now and then what you ought to be doing differently you know that's that's that's, that's that's so take care don't make that rash decision you know but calm down adjust yourself and let god you know uh, show you the right way god has an answer for you god has a solution for you god has help for you already you know so so renew your help in god renew your focus in god there's somebody this morning um this afternoon this evening whatever time you 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 you, you are with us you know you are you are you are you are greatly troubled because it looks like nothing is working nothing is working nothing is working but i bring you good news this morning because god showed this to me two days two nights ago you know that it is time it is time you know for for your for lines to begin to fall for you in pleasant places you know suddenly you will find very soon very soon and I declare from today you'll find everything begin to work work the things that never worked before they begin to line up for you line up for you and then last thing i would like to encourage you is please 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 
follow the example of our Lord Jesus Christ. He said to us in John 8, 29, he said, my father, the one who sent me, has not left me alone because I do always the things that please him. You know, the greatest secret of victory in, both in life and in eternity is to please God, to please God. If you can make it your determination every day to be focused about God, to focus about God and to focus on how you can please him, you know, then it will make a great difference. You know, my brother, there was this, this same lady, you know, yes. by the time we finished, I shared her testimony mm -hmm. who got healed in the school, yes. you know, by the That's time right. we, we finished that course, because everybody, they go and do a short video and, and mm -hmm. what they have, mm -hmm. she said, her prayer life has changed. Wow. She says now when she prays in the morning, she's also asking God, how are you feeling today? Wow. <laughs> because one of the things we do in the school is to understand what happens in the, in the throne right. of God. That's we take right. into the room of God. That's right. She says now ask what, what, you know, she's not got focused on herself. Now asking what God doing. And that lines with, our lost, with the lost prayer. Mm -hmm. Our Father what's in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth. God has an agenda. He has Absolutely. something he wants to do. Yes. All, all these things, but who will help me do what I want That's to right. do? That's you right. know, and so, so I want to beg you this mm -hmm. morning, mm -hmm. you know, this afternoon, this evening to make it your, your determination from today to live a life pleasing God. You just think about it. What, how, how, how can I please God? How can God be pleased with me? Mm -hmm. What does God want to do? You know, yeah, we all have our wants and have our own agenda. So what if you, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you, because if your wants we are unlimited, but if you focus on God who is unlimited, who is unlimited, then he can satisfy both your wants and his own. Absolutely. So you know, I wish you had more time, doctor. And please, I know when you have a next opportunity, you will come and, you know, just give us more insight of the you know what God is doing in your life in Aberdeen and just to give us information about the series the series of teaching because I know there's a next one coming but we haven't got time to you know to go into this that discussion but I know that you can go to the website the information is right on the screen go there and find out all the information and how you can get some of this teaching that will impact your life you know what the secret of life is to know and to understand the times and season and some of this has been given to this great man of God to share this revelation so that you can live a fulfilled life you know what i thank you so much for coming and uh please say goodbye to our viewers well if i say goodbye i want to thank god for this man yes. <laughs> it's a great great man of yes, god what he's doing is, is so important and yes, i also know what you did in in uh, uganda yes. building yes. a church for the community absolutely, um, absolutely. i mean and then they hand it over to to the local church that's right, yeah, that's so, right, yeah. so so i want to thank god for you and for what is what you do here yes so people of god and even those who are strangers to God, welcome again into, into, into this space. Thank you for sharing your time with us, and God bless you richly. In Jesus' name, amen. Until next time, God bless you. This is Richard Cunningham and Dr. Mark Osa Egohin, all the way from Aberdeen. Thank you so much, and God bless you. Watching Faith World TV. Faith World TV, changing the world with the Word of God.